Good morning, fellow hobby machinists. It's Olin Nemec coming to you from my shop in southern New Hampshire. Today I will be sharing some thoughts on my new LMS 5550 bench mill. I'm going to tell you about a little upgrade I met for made for the quill lock. The quill lock gets zoomed in here. comes with this little note loose and lock and it, it's just a little allen bolt that you loosen and tie tighten with uh tighten and loosen with an allen key but you know i'm looking at this going i really don't want to be fooling around with an extra tool to do something that I probably will do frequently you know I get the quill set to a certain depth and it's just you know I want to lock things up so that's just a little m10 thread and I got to thinking you know what's out there and I looked looked on some catalogs a little machine shop they sell um, a knob with an m10 stud in it and I thought, okay, that's that's the right idea, but maybe I can come up with something. And I got to thinking, you know, I could use a machine knob. I've got a few laying around, but nothing was the right size. So went on Amazon, went looking for knobs. And lo and behold, as I'm looking for knobs, I found something that really I didn't expect to find. And that's a knob that might look familiar. A gear shifter. And this is a really nice knob because it's all aluminum, fits in the hand nice, and it had an, a, um, a piece, a bushing to go in it that's uh, M10. So I had some uh, threaded rod and I made it up. So now I have a little custom made knob to lock the quill don't need another tool to to use it and it's kind of fun comes in all kind came in several colors uh, but I like blue because it fit the color scheme of the rest of the uh, mill um, my only regret is this I was looking at machine knobs I happened to find this gear shifter knob this this ball blue colored knob and I just bought it and in showing this to my son he goes well Adam Savage has got some knobs that look like billiard balls eight balls and it all of a sudden occurred to me I bet there's more shifter knobs and I google or I uh, searched on Amazon and there were 400 pages of shifter knobs I'm probably happy just to have this blue ball, but I can't help but think, you know, wouldn't it have been cool to have a skull or some other design there? So maybe when I get bored with this, I can make another one. But uh, just a little upgrade that I made for my little machine shop bench mill, and I thought I'd share it. I hope you found it useful. Have a good day.